Okay, let's see. I got asked why do dairy products thicken mucus and cause nasal uh, congestion? Well, let's see. I think that happens. I mean, I did a little research because you didn't say don't wiki Wikipedia it. And um, really, what I've found is people saying that there is no connection and that it's basically the viscosity of the milk that makes you notice the amount of mucus that you have but I don't believe that I think that um, the the dairy companies are putting out a lot of nonsense and and sponsoring a lot of studies about milk that just aren't true so um, I really think that you probably have a milk allergy and I think most people have milk allergies and they don't even know it and they won't allow the research out about it because milk is the milk industry is huge and they have a big lobby and lots of scientists and lots of people you know trying to convince people to drink milk and when milk is actually really bad for you um, and the fact that your body is producing that excess mu mucus is evidence that you really don't you shouldn't be drinking milk um, in general, I'm going to guess you're on Afropunk, so you're probably black or got some black in you or got some black friends, so you could tell them that if you're not black. That, um, especially black people, milk doesn't really work for most of us. Some of us can drink it, but in general, we're a, a, we have a high rate of lactose intolerance um, and, and allergies and to milk. So, um, like, it's not even the best source of calcium which is the lie that they've been telling us for years. And I think some people have been sued over that, saying that, you know, the government said that we should be drinking milk and milk is good for us when milk is actually really bad. Cow's milk is for cow's babies. And if you notice, most people, like, you don't, you wouldn't go around, like, sucking on someone's teeth or whatever because, you know, humans don't eat, drink milk after a certain period in time from their mothers and that's pretty much when you should stop drinking milk it's after you stop drinking it from your mother because you get you have this um hormone that releases that allows you to drink and process milk and after you're born that actually starts to subside so you stop that's why when you get older and older and older and older uh you start stop being able to drink milk more and more and more because I used to be able to drink milk and I can't drink milk anymore I still do it and get just get sick because I, I love milk products um, and I love cheese and ice cream and that kind of stuff but I, don't, I won't drink a glass but yeah it's because as you get older that area that releases that enzyme that allows you to process milk it starts to die out and you can't it doesn't release it anymore so yeah, stop drinking milk. That shit's bad for you. Cow's milk is for cow's babies. It's not for you. You can get calcium from leafy greens. They're lying to us. Stop drinking milk. It's terrible for you.